Bismillah Rahman Rahim. In this video, I will draw this figure in AutoCAD. Let's start. So, first, I will make this portion. The diameter of this circle is given 33.75. The diameter of this circle 51.75. And the radius of this circle 37.5. Let's draw it. Click on Start Drawing. Click on Circle Arrow. Center Diameter. Click Enter Diameter 33.75. Zoom out from Mouse Wheel. Click on UCS. Click on this point and drag towards this corner. Again click on circle arrow, center diameter, specify same center point, enter diameter 51.75. Click on circle arrow, center radius, enter radius 37.5. Now I will draw this circle. So for this first I will look at the center point of this circle. If you see the figure dimension, so this radius is given 73.5 and the downward distance is also given 15.75. Let's look at the center point and then drawing this circle. Click on circle arrow, center radius, enter radius 73.5. Now click on line, make a horizontal line from this center point towards this side, but make sure that this line crosses this circle. Click now enter a downward distance of 15.75 which is given in the dimension of the figure. Now make a horizontal line towards left side which crosses this circle. Escape. So this is the center point of this circle. And the radius of this circle is given 26.25. Let's draw it. Click on circle arrow, center radius. Click on this point. Now enter radius 26.25. Now select all these lines and the circle and erase it. Now I will make this fillet. So the fillet radius is given 76.5. Let's make it. I will make this by 10 10 radius command. Click on circle arrow. Click on 10 10 radius. Click on this circle. This circle enter radius 76.5. Now I will make this fillet. So here the diameter is given. The fillet diameter is given 33.75. If we divide 33.75 by 2, it becomes 16.8. 7, 5, which is the radius. This is the radius of this fillet. This fillet. Let's draw it. Again, click on circle arrow, click on tangent radius, click on this circle, click on this circle, enter radius 16.875. Now press TR, double enter, and trim the unnecessary portion. Escape. Now I will draw these two circles. So for this first I will look at the center point. This distance is given 102 mm from this center towards this center. And the diameter of this circle is given 22.5. The diameter of this circle 49.5. Let's draw it. Click on line. From this center point make a downward line of 102 mm. Escape. Now click on circle arrow. Center diameter. Click on this point. Enter diameter 22.5. Again click on circle arrow, center diameter, click on this point, enter diameter, this time 49.5. Now erase this line. Now I will make this line. This line is connected with the tangent point of this circle, the tangent point of this circle. And then this radius is also given, which is the fillet radius, 37.5. This is actually a fillet radius. So let's draw it, then you will understand clearly. Click on line, click on the quadrant of this circle, make a downward line of any length, escape, now click on circle arrow, click on 10, 10 radius, click on this line and click on this circle. Now enter radius 37.5. Now press TR, double enter and trim the unnecessary portion. Escape. Now I will draw this line. First I will erase the ink to see clearly. So this distance is given 18 mm. It means that 9 mm from this center line towards this side and 9 mm towards this side. Let's make this line first. Click on line. Then from this quadrant towards this quadrant make a straight line. Vertically escape. Now enter O for offset from the keyboard. Enter offset distance 9 mm. Now click on this line, towards this side, click on this line, towards this side. 
Please escape. Now this billet radius is also given and this billet radius is also given. So this is radius of 7 mm and this is radius of 10 mm. Let, let's make these two fillet first. Enter F from the keyboard for fillet. Now click on radius. Enter radius 7 mm. Now click on this circle. Click on this line. Again F enter from the keyboard for fillet. Now click on radius. Enter radius 10 mm. Now click on this circle and click on this line. Now first I will make this circle by offset of this circle 15 mm and then making this fillet. So the fillet radius is given which is 7.5 given over here. So first draw this circle by offset of this circle 15 mm. Enter O for offset. Enter offset distance 15 mm. Now click on this circle towards this side press escape now F enter from the keyboard for fillet click on radius enter radius 7.5 now click on this circle and click on this circle now press TR double enter trim this portion and this portion press escape now if we see the figure so this radius is given 53.25 this radius is given from this midpoint of this line the line is drawn from the quadrant of this circle towards the quadrant of this circle from this midpoint this radius is given 53.25 let's make this circle click on circle arrow center radius from this midpoint make a circle of 53.25 enter now we will offset this circle by 15.75 to get this portion first I will erase the ink to see clearly the dimension so I will offset this circle by 15.75 to get this portion enter O for offset from the keyboard enter with offset distance 15.75 click on this circle towards this side press escape now we will enter this fillet so this fillet is given this fillet is given 11.25 first we will erase the ink to see clearly the dimension so this fillet is given 11.25 and this fillet is given 20.25 this fillet is also given 7.5 let's draw these fillets enter F from the keyboard for fillet now click on radius enter radius 11.25 enter click on this circle click on this circle now again F enter for fillet click on radius enter radius 7.5 this time now click on this circle and this circle this fillet is also given which is 20.25 this fillet again F enter from the keyboard for fillet click on radius enter fillet radius 20.25 now click on this circle and click on this circle now press tr double enter trim the unnecessary portion this portion and this portion this portion this portion and this portion now erase it this portion now select this line and erase it select this line and erase it now i will make uh, this portion so the radius of this circle is given 9 mm let's write so click on circle arrow click on tangent radius if we see this figure so this circle is tangent with this circle and this circle is tangent with this circle let's uh, make it click on this circle and click on this line enter radius 9 mm again click on circle arrow tangent radius click on this circle and this line enter radius 9 mm again now press tr double enter trim this portion this portion this portion and this portion press escape l enter from the keyboard for line joining the quadrant of this circle and this circle press escape press tr double enter trim this portion so this figure is exactly made according to the given dimension